Hello everybody, Mike Arnold here, co-founder of Pat Training Partners along with Bob Iacchino. So, again, rotation zone holding, spiking up, closing just slightly above our 54.30 level, poking through it all the way up to 54.87, but closing pretty much right on our level before reversing back lower. Uh, finding key resistance, we had, what, 54.96, it got up to 54.87, again, remember, it's an area. Those levels can now be updated. This looks like it's running out of momentum, though, especially with this kind of bearish bar. Uh, so, what are we looking for now? To the upside minor level at, uh, I'm just going to be watching 55.69, 56.51, and 57.29 as the next key levels higher. Lower, especially if we close below key area we'll be watching is below the rotation zone but i'm going to be watching to see if we break below this bar's low 51.95 then i'll be watching for a return to 50.56 and then we're going to switch over to the daily chart daily chart 50.56 that's right inside the rotation zone on the daily basis so that's going to be the first very key level and that's also the 25 percent retracement from this run-up so that's going to be very key support if we did fall through there. Next key area, 48.40. Switch over to Ethereum. Ethereum trying to run up, not able to make a new high, unlike Bitcoin coming back down, selling off to 50 period exponential moving average on the four hour chart. Still managing at this time of this recording to keep a closing bar right now above the 172 level. We'll be watching to see on a move below 170. Then we'll be watching for the lower prices. Same still key levels to the upside. Above 187.98, 193.81, 199.65. Let's take a look at that daily chart though. So we come down, see so spiking right at that 8 and recovering. So if we get a, especially a closing bar below 170, that'll be into the rotation zone. Then we'll start watching for the bigger pullback. 37.5 is coming in with this little ledge right here. So this is prior uh, closing resistance becoming support at the 37 half so 164 69 we'll call it 165 then below that return right down to the bottom of the rotation zone about 156 to 157 let's see this do we get a divergence 88 58 87 yes we did get a divergence so on this last push up divergence on the daily so that's definitely running out of momentum, but we're still going to wait for that key uh, close below the 169 before we start watching for the bigger pullback. So adjust any stops accordingly. So we have for you on Bitcoin and Ethereum, and we'll talk to everyone soon. Bye for now.